It's I like to to. barbecue. Yeah. Hey guys. Hey. It's like Charlie's Angels. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, what you guys got? Old Stone. Nice. I've got nice. Egg batter with Reese's and waffles. Nice. Amazing. That looks so good. You know it. That's oh, awesome. Dough. Nice. Yeah. And? and? Chocolate egg batter. That's great. And I just want to say this highlights how awful it is to work at Blue Table Painting. You know, just the times that you have with the people that you work with are just terrible. I hate ice cream. Yeah, worst memories ever on opposite day. All right, thanks a lot, guys. Zach. What's up, Sean? Hey, Zach. The Walking Dead? Yes. Oh, that's brilliant. <laughs> what the heck? All right, great. I am glad we don't have a dress code anymore. Okay, hey, let's see your Kairos Fate Weaver. I think I like what I see. It's actually been really fun to do. So you took a regular... Just a regular uh, Lord of Tzench, Greater Demon. Tzench. And uh, just started converting it up. The guy wanted a, a Kairos Fate Reaver. He felt the one that they had for uh, yeah. stock was just it's a little not too awesome tame. enough. It is, and it's small too. Oh, he's got like the rock kind of lifting up off the base. Yeah, I, the narrative I thought was uh, he just summons the rocks up as he walks like across the Ultimate power. Field. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> ultimate, I like the whole kind of almost watch like thing going on. All right, hey, thanks a lot, Zach. John's got, oh no, 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 you need to record me doing it now. So John's like, hey, try my homemade salsa. And I gotta tell you, alarm bells are going off. But uh, here we go. So it's like going to be amazing. Guatemalan insanity peppers in mm -hmm. it or something like that? Yeah. Oh man, I'm leaking just smelling this. <laughs> is, it re is it hot? Uh, not terribly. Not terribly? It's pretty good. Are you one of those people where you can endure anything? Well, if it could, Victoria could eat it, then it's not that hot. Yeah. She has very low, high, hot tolerance. Okay. Is it good? You know, there's that moment when you eat something really hot when you're like, oh, this isn't so bad. <laughs> and then it and comes. Then boom. Yeah. How was it? How was it? No, I think it's good. You think it's good? No. Okay. It's just got a little bit of spice to it. Awesome. Let's try it again. He said, try it, not eat the whole thing. Like, what, trying <laughs> it is no more than one? I don't know. Mm, good stuff. <laughs> You're taking a third one. <laughs> He's gonna come back to no more salsa. My homemade salsa. But he did offer it to everyone in the studio, so he should expect That's that. Good. That yeah. Did you make this? Yeah. It's good, there wasn't it? Weird in it. No. Because now's the time to jump me with that. Yeah, my hair's in there. <laughs> Gross! No, I'm just kidding. Fingernail you clippings, now? usual. Yeah, no, there's, uh, there's just like Roma tomatoes and a red onion and mm. a poblano and jalapenos and anchos Ooh. and then uh, some cilantro, mm. olive oil, garlic. I'll oh, definitely taste the cilantro. Oh, wow. Yeah, the sal I think if I do it next time, I'll use a little less cilantro because I think it's a little cilantro y. Oh, I like okay. it anyway. Right, More lime. Yeah. We did, there was one. Uh, Thanks a lot, Karen. Hey, what's going on? Uh, just stretching. Stretching out. Good. You're kind of between projects now, right yeah. now, right? Yeah, right. they're checking off. They're going to sign up, uh, checking off the quality control on the assembly. We're going to be doing some more of that awesome Tau stuff. All right, fantastic. All right, Alora, what you working okay. on? Okay, I'm working on this egg drop soup. All right, Real awesome. Real hard. <laughs> All right, Ben, what's going on? Ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on a second. Ben, let's take a look. Oh, holy <laughs> Hannah. Remember the We're going to check out something. So, uh, Infinity, the Infinity guys gave us, if I may, gave us some figures, and all we had to do is paint them. Paint them awesome. Swag for exposure. So you, you're going to see a lot more of this. Wow, that freehand is wicked. I'm bringing that back, by the way. All right. Thanks a lot. Isn't that awesome? Are you pimping your salsa all around? Yes, I'm. This is great. Thank Are we going to see like a little up. vending machine with like Good. salsa Chum eight ninety nine? <laughs> yeah, I would buy it. Yeah. I actually, I think that's really good. It's that's really good like salsa. Yeah. I don't know. Did you catch that? Yeah, no, I got it. Okay. We got it. We got it, Roberto. So, uh, so <laughs> what, what are you working on? Um, magnetizing some Necrons. Those Immortals. Set. I believe so. So they have their different weapon options. Yeah. Now, the problem with that is the spine connects to a single set of tubing, 
Right. So every torso is kind of keyed in for only one weapon. I see. So to magnetize it, you have to get a little creative. So okay. now I'm just going through and fixing all the wrists so everything lines up. Okay. I, I actually think that looks pretty good. Yeah, that looks nice. Hey, thanks a lot, Roberto. Good work. Oh, uh, any update on the uh, personal romance front? No. Nothing? One of them stopped talking to me. Oh. I don't even know what I did. Oh, there you go. So. Well, a lot of things can happen. Eh. Can't always work out. Things come and go. So. How's it going? Good. I'll take a half a second. Okay. Because one minute of Thomas is better than no minutes of Thomas. I accept this. How are you doing, Sean? Uh, I'm doing great. How about you? Pretty good. There's a there's a giant pile of uh, Zinch demons here. There is a giant yeah. pile. Of I'm not going to show the pile though. Not going. No pile. No pile. Everyone's pressuring me to show the pile, and I don't want to show the pile. Why? Do you, why don't you guys just leave me alone? A pile of towel weapons no, no, on my desk no, too. no. I'm not. Okay, I'll show the towel weapons. All right. All right, there's the pile. Everybody happy now? <laughs> but I'm not showing the original pile. Well, the original pile is long gone, so. All right, fantastic. All right, I'll see you guys Thanks. later. Hey, how's it going? Show off this demon. <laughs> All right, that is awesome. So he's splatting this guardian. Poor little guardian. I love the arm, like the, t the two arms back. Yeah. That gives it a sense of momentum. Guy, this is awesome stuff, man. This is had, really great. I had a pretty big budget. He wanted a lot done, and it was basically a lot of creativity, like just yeah, that's great. For me. And so I was yeah, like, I can go ham and have a lot of fun with it. So yeah, and you did go nuts. Yeah, I'm All doing right. the greater demon right now. Oh wow! Okay, I'm just getting started on him. So nothing really to show. So you. these are just demon princes. Those are demon princes. All right. Not quite All as right. powerful. Too. All right. Thanks. <laughs> go. Okay. I should. Uh, so me and Dave just played a game. With yeah. the lizard men, and uh, it's a special scenario. <clears throat> and uh, anyway, so it was kind of an unusual situation. But I had a unit of temple guard, and that new. Wait, so what was the scenario? It was from. It was like something wicked comes to Hagger's Dwarf or something. Okay. It's in the big, the big uh, rule right. book. Um, so you set up like a village. Yeah, we set up a village. It's actually okay. Upstairs. Um, but anyways, um, that's kind of complicated. But the the point of this is the predatory fighter rule, because each Saurus gets two attacks. Yeah. I basically came into the city with this big unit of temple guard, and I got assaulted by unit after unit of uh, like knights, of like knights and soldiers. Yeah. And I mean, part of it was luck, but you know, on a six to hit with predatory fighter, you get an extra attack. So I, I just see. had so many attacks, I would win combat and their strength five. You know, so I'd always right. Around. And then, yeah, they just sit there and I'd win combat and they just stand just on the ground in that courtyard. I took on everything. Wow, and, uh, that's great. I fought again. It wasn't great. Well, I would. <laughs> well, a good man gave up their lives to protect that city to negotiate. <laughs> a good man. So you're playing Empire. So you have an Empire army for fantasy? Oh, that's great. How many points are painted up? Um, I've probably got. 1500 to 17, I hereby challenge you to a game <laughs> with everything that you have painted. Okay. <laughs> Let's do it. Uh, whose ogres are these? Is this for a client this or was yours? The off the web store. Oh, it was. Doing some touch ups, fixing the so stone. somebody bought it. Somebody bought and it. And then they commissioned us to bring it up to speed. Yep. That's what yeah. we're doing. Yep. And by the way, that is a great option. And uh, when you go to the web store, there will be an option that you can click when you buy something to say, hey, have someone get in touch with me because I may want to have extra work done. It's not obligatory, uh, but uh, it's, a, it's a great way to get a new army going because it's just the web store is so inexpensive. So anyway, 